To get the LU70 up and running, hold the power button in until the LED turns blue and you hear the unit turn on. The first thing to do is select a server. Press the Options button at the bottom right, and then choose Servers. To add a server, press Create New. Here you can give it a name, your IP address, and two port numbers. Then hit Save. Now that the server has been selected, the next step is to connect to the server. Press the Connect button. As another option, you can have the LU70 automatically connect to your server upon boot up. To do that, press Options, then Settings, and then scroll down to click on Startup. Choose the setting labeled Power On and Connect with Calibration, then hit Save. Now choose your delay profiles. Press the button labeled Profiles, located at the bottom left of the screen. We recommend using Interview Mode for live shots, such as a toss or a live Q&A. Interview Mode typically gives you 1-2 to two seconds of delay. If you can afford a few more seconds of delay, Balanced Mode is suggested. Balanced Mode will increase the resiliency of the stream and usually comes in with 4-6 to six seconds of delay. The final mode is Max Quality. This is the most resilient profile because it has the most delay and buffer. The LU70 also offers the option of custom delay. In places with the worst cellular signal, custom delay is recommended. Each profile mode has its own drop down menu with resolution settings. We recommend using automatic resolution which will always use the appropriate resolution based on available bandwidth. Now you can plug in your camera through the middle BNC connection on the side of the unit. You will now see the feed coming through on the screen. The camera icon will be solid white, indicating either SD or HD resolution. Now you can begin transmitting the video by pressing the Transmit button. The bar at the top of the screen will display the current bandwidth and the delay selected. You can also see the status of each individual modem by going to Options, then selecting the Interfaces button. For any further questions, contact LiveView's 24-hour technical support.